Okay. Um. Um. I have done this video two times already. It's a bit messed up. Okay. So right now I'm at my stable place, and I'm just gonna show you how to put this halter on on and off. Um. Yeah. I just made it. So. I'm, like really happy. Okay. So. First, you see that it's like a little slot, and then you open it, and then you slide it out. Pretty simple. Okay, and then say so you have the horse, and you're like, hmm, I want to take my horse out for a job. So, let's see, slip it on like that, take it over its face like that, and then, sorry, oops, and then you have the two open little slots right there, those two open parts, so you just Sling this around, and then there's like a little hole, so, hold on, first you put it through one hole, and then put it through, oops, and then you put it through the other, it's pretty simple, so, let me get this on, hold on, sometimes it's not very simple, so, don't get frustrated, because that's what happens sometimes. Okay, so, I have another one that I need to show you. Okay, here we go. There. See? It's pretty easy. Other people just do it, like, flip it on up here. But I, I decided to do it differently because, well, there's no reason because I can't even do it, so that's why. <laughs> um, and I don't have the little slidey thingies. And I think this is just easier. And it looks better. I and mean, it looks more realistic to me. It does. Okay. Okay, so that, that's that one. This is Indiana Jones. That's his um, show name, and people call him Indiana or Jones. Okay. Mostly Indiana. Okay, anyway, this is Twilight. He's a nice show horse. Um, here at Labrador Retriever Stables. Well, actually, he belongs to Horse Line Stables. But more about the halter. Um, so, yeah, here's his gimp halter made of gimp. Um, my friend gave it to me. Let's see. You slide it off his nose and over his ears. Okay, so that's pretty simple. Yay! Okay, and then you can open it and make it smaller. And then, so that's what I did. You just, and then, to get it back on, you just slide it under his, this big part right here. You just slide it under his chin, over his mouth, the open part, and over his ears. <sighs> Skip's a bit tight. But good thing it doesn't come off. And it might be a bit loose. You could use it for a bridle. Like, take this. I made the sleeve up. It's really bad looking. Like, take this. Just clip it. Clip it on. It's clipped on. And then, like, toss it around it. And then, like, hold on. Um, You have to get it, like, up in there. Okay, and then you have it. And then it looks really nice. A bridle. I don't have very fancy stuff, so this is my first time making one. A nice one, like like with rings. The rings are square, if you were wondering. So I don't want any questions about hey what what size are the rings or what shape are the rings or I'm gonna be pretty PO. Okay, anyway, um so square rings. Um I also have um these are real silver. Okay, and um I also have um, gold rings, they are not real gold, they're rings, they're jump rings, they're not squares. I got it, it at Ben Franklin, and I got this stuff, I got the clips for Christmas, this from a friend, and this for Christmas. This came with the kit for this, it came in my stocking. He knew I made stuff like this, so, yeah. Um, so yeah, so if you need any tips, you can just ask me, and... Hopefully me and Indiana can help you out. Okay. So, thank you and bye-bye.